Hello, I am Jason Swan with DB Services, and today we're going to talk about Einstein Activity Capture. Einstein is Salesforce's artificial intelligence for CRM. We're going to go over how Einstein Activity Capture syncs your emails, calendars, and contacts to maintain accurate, up-to-date information about our clients in our Salesforce org. Einstein Activity Capture has a free edition that can be enabled in your org. In setup, go to the Einstein Activity Capture settings page and you can get started on the activation process. When setting it up, select an email application to sync to, such as Google Suite, Office 365, or Microsoft Exchange. If you have a Google Surface account for the Google Suite, you can set up Einstein Activity Capture for all users at once. If you don't, then each user can manually connect Einstein Activity Capture to their email. At this point, Einstein Activity Capture has been enabled for your org, but you still need to configure it. After naming the configuration, you can select if you want emails, events, and contacts to sync to Salesforce and in what direction. You can also set every contact to sync or just the contacts owned by the user. Moving on to the advanced settings, you can select how far back you want emails and events to sync, up to 180 days in the free version. You can also decide to sync private events, relate synced events to Salesforce records, and specify the conditions to sync contacts. Finally, select which users or profiles you want this configuration to apply to. Following that, you can optionally choose to exclude certain email addresses from syncing to Salesforce. This can be customer domains, internal domains, or specific email addresses. Next, you can define the default sharing settings for synced activities. If you choose not to automatically share activities, users can see what time emails and calendar events take place, but they cannot see any details beyond that. Users can always choose to manually share their activities with other users. If you ever want to make changes to the configuration, you can always edit any configuration settings or make additional configurations for different users and profiles that need to use Einstein Activity Capture. Now that Einstein Activity Capture is configured, users can connect their emails to Salesforce. If using the user level connection, Users can go to their personal settings, go to the email and calendar account sections, and add their email there. Once your email is connected, Einstein will start syncing your emails to related records. For instance, if one of your email messages is sent to the email of a contact, the message will appear as an event on that contact's records. Now that Salesforce is synced to your email, you can view all the relevant messages regarding your contacts in one convenient place. Einstein Activity Capture also has an option to provide insights on the email messages. When Einstein has insights for emails in a timeline, it will add tags for what it has found, such as commitments being made, competitors being mentioned, or someone being out of office. These insights make it easy to get a quick grasp on what has been discussed regarding your contacts, your accounts, and your opportunities. Einstein Activity Capture also has the option to make custom insights to mark on your email messages, but this feature is not available in the free version. If your calendar was synced to Salesforce when configuring Einstein Activity Capture, then you will see your calendar events appear in either Salesforce or your email application. On top of allowing you to conveniently view your entire schedule in one location, Einstein Activity Capture will also link these calendar events to related records like contacts. If the private event sync option was selected in the configuration settings, then private events will sync to Salesforce, but other users will not be able to see details about these events. The Salesforce calendar only shows events that synced to a Salesforce event, but you can view captured but unsynced events in Salesforce by turning on the option in the Einstein Activity Capture settings. Now, Einstein Activity Capture also syncs your email contacts to Salesforce. Based on the configuration settings, any or all of your email contacts will become Salesforce contact records. The same is true with Salesforce contacts becoming email contacts. When you create an email contact, be sure to include a company so that Salesforce knows which account to connect to. If Salesforce cannot find the associated account, the contact will be placed in the unresolved item list. If you want to remove the contact, you will also need to remember to delete it on Salesforce and in your email contact list, as Einstein Activity Capture does not automatically delete both contacts when one is deleted. With Einstein Activity Capture syncing all this data, you may want to delete portions of data at some point to free up storage space in your org. In other cases, some users and contacts may also request that their data not be used to train Einstein's machine learning model. Either way, it is very easy to delete this data in Salesforce. 
The data policy section in setup will allow you to delete this data based on email addresses or users. You can also choose which emails and users to exclude from training the machine learning model. Remember to update your Einstein configuration settings to exclude certain users, profiles, or contacts from resyncing with Salesforce. With that, we have a good idea of what benefits you'll see when enabling Einstein Activity Capture for your Salesforce org. Thank you for watching. If you want to learn more, contact us at dbservices.com.